Hi, I'm Dan from the team at Slack, and I'm gonna show you how to use the activity view in Peaks inside Slack to have more focused work. The activity view is the one place for everything that needs your attention. Mentions, threads, reactions, and app notifications. At the top, you'll see the different categories of activity notifications. All has every notification you're connected to. Mentions are ones where your name is tagged, Threads are any thread that has a new update, and reactions are for any emoji added to your messages, and apps are for messages from Slackbot and any other bots inside your workspace. You can click on each notification to have the relevant message open in the side view to the right. Here's a pro tip. Consider toggling the unread button at the very top. That way, you'll know right away the activity notifications you haven't read yet. But how can you use the activity view to work more efficiently? Well, let's say you just started work for the day. You can save time by going straight to the activity view to learn about everything that happened as you were away. You can see that your team gave a thumbs up emoji for your last message, and you've also been mentioned on a thread that you should reply to right away. In minutes, you're up to speed, and now you can tackle your work knowing you're all caught up just by using the activity view. Let's say you want to quickly look into a view without actually clicking into it. You can now peek into any view you want by hovering over it. That way you can quickly see items inside the view without actually opening them up, meaning you can stay focused on what you're working on. For example, say you want to send a DM to a teammate about some recent activity, but you can't remember the exact wording. You can stay in the DM view and then peek into the activity view to copy the phrasing and paste it into your message. Now that's efficient. That's it. You now know how to use the activity view and peeks to increase your productivity with Slack. If you want to go deeper, check out our other playlist or visit slack.com forward slash help to learn more. Thanks so much for watching.